Like sin? Did you just have sex with Ford? What? What are you talking about? Well, I, I come home and, and Ford is here and you're all flustered. I am not flustered. And then I found a condom wrapper on the floor. So, so, so what, you think that we slept together? Well, what else am I supposed to think? That you're my best friend and that you trust me? So is that a no? Are you saying that you didn't sleep with him? All right, man, I should get going. And I should get back to work. Hey, man, don't worry about Langston, all right? Yeah, yeah, we're good. We just need to spend a little more time together. Never hurts. All right, I'll see you at home. Okay? See ya. Better get out of here before we get into here. You're such a user. All right, you want to talk? Let's go someplace private. Why? So you can tell me what I already know, that you dumped me so you could sleep with this Langston chick? It is none of your business who I sleep with. I have a right to know when you started hooking up with her. Says who? My doctor. So, were you sleeping with Langston while you were sleeping with me? I love Marco. You know that. I didn't ask you about Marco. I asked you about Ford. And for some reason, you can't look me in the eye and tell me that you didn't sleep with him. Why is that? Maybe I just don't like being accused, okay? Or maybe something's going on and you're just not telling me. Lang, you used to tell me everything. Now you can't even look at me? What do you want me to say? That you're not sleeping with him. Oh my God, please tell me that that's not why you've been acting so weird. Because you've been lying to me and to Marco and to everyone else? I've tried to talk to you for over a month. And every time you either, you need more time or you're too stressed out and you have to run here and you have to run there. And then even when you are here, you're so jumpy that no one even wants to be around okay, you. Okay, fine then. I'll just move out. How no, about that? Yeah? I don't want you to go anywhere. Not until you tell me what's going on, Lang. I love you. We all love you. You're pushing us away right now, even Marco. You need to tell me what's going on. I can't. Yes, you can. No. You can tell me. Whatever it is, you can tell me. No, I you say that. No. I'll be okay with it because I'll still love you. I know that you've been having problems with Marco. And I know that you've had a crush on me. It's not a crush, okay? Then whatever it is, I don't know. I Plus slept with him, all right? You happy? All right, look, if you have a, a problem, I don't want to tell you. It wasn't me. I always use a condom. And that's supposed to protect someone emotionally? So you don't have anything? No. But I could have, the way you sleep around. Or maybe it's you, Hannah. Maybe you're a crazy slut. Hey! Man, don't talk to her like that. Oh, see, Hannah, you don't need me. You got Cole. Wait, that's funny. I thought Cole had a baby and a girlfriend, but who am I to judge? She's just a friend. But I don't like the way you treat her. Ford? Right here? Right right before I came Yeah, in? we did it, okay? We had sex. Did he force you? No, he didn't force me. Of course not. So, oh my, were you guys drinking? Do I look drunk? Like some Marco, he, he could come in. Eric, does that work? I knew you'd look at me like that. Sorry, I'm just trying to understand how this could all happen. How... How you could end up having sex on our couch with Marco's teacher? Well, it didn't just happen. It's, um... It's been going on for a while. 